Anathis posted a new leak on Twitter. The description is for a new expansion pack called Love Struck, which may be our romance expansion pack that was teased in this season's roadmap. So the description includes information about different features. So going from the top under Plan Hotter Dates, check Cupid's Corner app for matches that make your Sims heart flutter, set up a date with a new date planning system, choose what you and what you want to do and where you want to go, crafting romantic rendezvous that leave your Sims swooning. Sims can connect by playing games, cuddling in bed, or romantic basket picnic type thing. Um, all about attraction. So turn-ons and turn-offs will determine how attracted Sims are to each other. Some Sims will like or dislike different interactions, and partners may have different satisfaction levels. Some Sims interact with each other or I'm sorry, how Sims will interact with each other will also affect whether their relationship dynamic is wholesome, steamy, strained, or unpredictable. So I'm kind of curious if the relationship dynamic is going to work like growing together, where the likes and dislikes affect the dynamic and we can set it and create a Sim. This description's kind of unclear, but it seems the same way. So in growing together, your relationship can be strict, jokester, supportive like this there's different categories and some relationships are specific to different groups like a parent child relationship may be different than like spouses relationships to each other so i'm kind of curious how that looks i also was a image of the possible pre-order items which includes a plushie runny eyeliner and a basic breakup bed not sure though because of course this is the leak so take this with a grain of salt but pre-orders are supposed to start June 27th. So I'm assuming that the trailer is going to come out June 27th. So I'm super curious. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Based on this possible description for the expansion pack, is this something that you think is expansion pack worthy? And how do you think these different features are going to play out?